This is a newly produced clone. The doctor removed the mechanical umbilical cord, and blood mixed with unidentified liquid flowed out. Then the doctor cut open the artificial womb, and placed a negative pressure mask on the clone's face. After repeatedly suctioning, the clone began to breathe on its own. Next, the doctor coated him and put on a wristband, then sent him to the so-called underground shelter. Underneath the laboratory, there are tens of thousands of clones being nurtured. Their only purpose is to provide spare organs to the original. The head of the laboratory implants false memories into them, making these clones believe that the outside world has been destroyed by nuclear war, and that this is the only safe refuge. Lincoln accidentally stumbled upon the upper level of the shelter. Here, he saw the pregnant woman who had obtained qualification to go to Paradise Island. By now, she had completed giving birth, but instead of handing the child to her, the nurse injected her with a mysterious drug. In less than a minute, the pregnant woman's heartbeat stopped. Then the nurse gave the baby to a couple, and the wife looked exactly like the pregnant woman who had just been killed. It turns out that they not only provide organs here, but also offer surrogacy services. On the other side, the recently awarded black man was anesthetized and placed on the operating table. The doctor was about to remove his liver, for organ transplantation to the original, but halfway through the operation, 